guys. Today we are in Gatlinburg, Tennessee, and we're inside one of the number one rated aquariums in the United States, Ripley's. We're just gonna take you around and just show you everything they have to offer. Maybe play some music along the way. I'm looking forward to seeing all these sharks. So are you ready, Bobby? I'm ready. Let's rock and roll. Let's rock and roll. Hours for the Ripley's Aquarium, Monday through Thursday, nine to eight, Friday through Sunday, nine to 10. Aquarium's very easy to find. It's right when you come in the Gatlinburg. Off to the right, there's Anakista. We came across this bridge to get here, but you can also come up these steps or they have ramps in here. There's the ramp from the road. You don't have to travel up any steps. Just come right around there. Right up through here. Straight in the Ripley's. Ripley's also has a parking garage. Right around the back. Let's look at the prices. 12 and up, $39.99. 6 to 11, $24.99. Children, 2 to 5, $9.99. If you want to do other Ripley's attractions, this will save you a lot of money by comboing. They have 10 other attractions you can do. You can see them in front of you right now, the different ways that you can get them. And if you wanna get all 10, you can do that. There's some different events and here are the prices. The aquarium plus three attractions are $69.99. If you want the aquarium in five, it only goes up $20 to $79.99. And here's the price for all 10 plus the aquarium. About $110, that'll save you $117 if you choose to do that. This is a list of the 10 attractions included with the aquarium. You can either get this online or just buy it at the door when you arrive. Let's get started on our tour of Ripley's Aquarium of the Smokies. This is the first thing you're greeted with when you come in a large aquarium. The guest services is off to your right. And as you head down this way, you will see a playground for the kids. And off to the left, there'll be a guy starting off with one of your first photo ops. We're gonna play music mainly through this video. We hope you guys enjoy it. We're gonna start off with the tropical rainforest.
Water Chemistry Laboratory. As the pumps force the water up through the sand bottle, the bacteria eat, digest, life support systems. I was reading this. The aquarium recycles 13 times more water than the entire city of Gatlinburg. To maintain water processing goes on 24 hours a day. What do you think of this view, Bobby? This is probably one of my favorite sections. I can stand here all day and just watch them swim around. Sharks get pretty close. Yeah. Look at this one. And if you want to get closer, you can go out and get in that boat and look through the glass bottom. Really see them. If you want to ride the glass bottom boat adventure, you're going to have to pay an extra fee. We will show you that here in a second, but they do give you a lot of info on what you are seeing. Directly below this, you can see the people mover that's going to head below the sharks. You're going to go right underneath this tank. That is something to see and the kids would absolutely love that view. Something I really enjoyed seeing were the skeletons. This one is of a humpback whale. It is 45 feet long, and there are a few other ones around this area. They're right above the kids' playground. I would say most kids and adults would love looking at these skeletons. And if I was younger, I think I would enjoy playing in this playground, maybe about 50 years ago.
Make sure when you go inside Ripley's, you find out what time the different shows are that are happening for the day. It's worth seeing them while you're here. price for the glass bottom boat just go up to this screen select what time you want to go it's twelve dollars and 99 cents and pick your times that are available I took a little break just to relax and watch the fish i like the music that they're playing it's very fitting isn't it? it's kind of eerie it is well, i think under the water is kind of eerie it is the unknown and it's a big display here goes a shark going by we need a break this place is pretty good size Let's get ready to head through Shark Lagoon, my favorite thing here at the Ripley's Aquarium. You can jump on the people mover or just walk through it. You decide. Here's a look at the glass bottom boat that you can take out for $13. The special exhibit going on right now is the Ring of Fire. Look at that volcano in front of us. Let's walk around and see what they have. This is an 
nice area for the kids and the adults for hands-on activities. Gives you some information about the islands. Which one do you want to see, John? Go for Hawaii. Hawaii. Fire and water meet in the Hawaiian Islands. Nice. Upside down jellies. Ripley's just has so many hands on activities to do. Really enjoyed the Ring of Fire exhibit. There is just too much to see in here. You could spend a whole day if you wanted to take in everything. In front of the restaurant, they have this gigantic area with stingrays that you can watch while you're eating. The restaurant is named Feeding Frenzy. It looks like this snowman has already helped himself to a hamburger. There's a quick look at the entrees and the starters the drinks and the snacks. I like this cup, upsized to a souvenir cup for $6.99. And we're gonna have a penguin parade soon. You can look on this map and decide where you're gonna stand for it. They have tunnels you can crawl through and come out right in front of the penguins, right inside that glass tube if you want to get a closer look at them. This area is where you can decide whether you want to buy any of the pictures that they've taken of you and your family as you've walked through Ripley's. Let's see how. You just scan the card they gave you when they took your picture, view the photo, and there's the prices if you want to buy them. They did this throughout the whole place, so you probably have a lot of different pictures to choose from. If you want to touch a stingray, they have this large area for you to try. Just put your hand on top of the water and see if they will come up to you. How'd you like to meet that? I won't have to worry about ever meeting that because I don't go too deep in the water. Jason stayed him would take one of those out though. He did in a couple movies, all by himself. You can feed the stingrays for only $4. And when you leave, you're gonna exit through the gift shop. Davy Jones and Captain Jack made out of car parts. If you look close, you can see them.
have a touch jellies area. Unfortunately, they were resting when we got to this section. Would have liked to touch them. I bet they're soft or slimy. Not sure which. Too bad we didn't stay longer. We could have came back and tried it. Over on this section, you can create your own jellyfish. The penguins are gonna do a parade for us here in a minute, but we decided we would try a hot dog, french fries, and a Coke from the feeding frenzy. This costs $10. We're going to now exit Ripley's Aquarium after having a great time here today. This is a place that is worth coming back to. They have picnic tables you can eat at right out front. Because when you buy a ticket, you can come back the same day. Maybe come back in the evening when it's less crowded. We just left Ripley's Aquarium of the Smokies. What did you think about it? I had a great time. We spent four hours in here and still didn't see everything. You can come here on a rainy, cold day and spend all day here. There's a lot of activities for the kids to do. You can get something to eat, you have the gift shop. Check out the Penguin Parade. I enjoyed yeah, that. Fun. We've never seen that before. The kids could crawl through the tunnel and get up close with the penguins. You can touch a jellyfish or a stingray. Just a lot of different activities to do here. But don't just come when it's cold outside. Mm -hmm. Come in the summertime. And a huge play area for the kids. My favorite thing was seeing those sharks. You can either walk mm -hmm. down through there, which I did because I kept jumping off all the time just to just take pictures and video. I or think, you can just go on the people mover. I think they spent the longest time in that area, didn't mm -hmm. we? We did. Best thing to do though, if you're coming here, is to check their webpage. They have so many different activities and events going on. We couldn't even tell you all of them. I know they have mermaids here in the summertime. I think they have 21 and over sip and sleep. I don't know if you stay all night. Just a lot of different stuff. If you plan on doing the aquarium, Maybe add some more attractions. That's the cheapest way to go. I mean, you can buy a ticket to come in here, but they have several other things with miniature golf and a haunted house. And the more you buy, the cheaper the ticket is. We'd like to thank Ripley's for having us out today. I will leave a link in the description of this video of the aquarium and the other attractions. Make sure to click on that and see what they have to offer. Come here to Gatlinburg, visit the number one rated aquarium in the United States. So if you like this video, give us a thumbs up and subscribe. Yeah, so until we meet again, J&B have left the building.